Hello everyone, and welcome to Sunday Friends. My name is Miss Jenny, and in God's Word today, Jesus teaches us that it is not how much we give to others, but with what kind hearts we give. Let's listen to God's story today. Let's begin our time together with the sign of the cross. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. God our Father, as we light our candle today, We thank you for sending your Son, Jesus, to show us the way, and for your Holy Spirit, who is always there when we need help. Let us always be children of your light to the world. Amen. Dear Lord Jesus, hear our prayers as we bring to you our cares. Please forgive us any wrongs. As we sing your sorry song, help us to be kind each day in our thoughts and all we say. Let's get our bodies ready to hear God's word. Let's listen with our ears. We'll watch with our eyes. We'll keep our lips and hands quiet. And we'll listen with our hearts. Alleluia, praise the Lord, praise the Lord, praise the Lord. Alleluia, praise the Lord, Jesus, King of glory. When Jesus was in the temple with some of his disciples one day, he noticed that there were some people putting money into the collection box. People who came into the temple were expected to do this to help their church. Many of the rich people would often bring huge bags of money. It made them look important. They had so much money, they weren't going to miss what they gave. But Jesus noticed that an old woman came to the temple. She only had two small coins. It was all the money she owned and she put it in the collection box. She had to buy food for herself, but she wanted to share what she had with others, even if she had to do without. When Jesus saw this, he turned to his disciples and said, this old woman has given more than any of these other people. They gave money that they could spare, but she has given everything she has. She gave it because she loved God and she loved other people. Giving should be a way to show love, never a way to show off. Let's wonder about God's Word today. Now it's time to say yes to God to show we believe in him. Do you believe in God who made you and me? 
Yes. Do you believe in Jesus, whose mother is Mary? Yes. Do you believe that Jesus came to show us how to live and to love? Yes. Do you believe Jesus died for us on the cross to open heaven above? Yes. When we need help to follow him each and every day, God gives us the Holy Spirit to guide us on our way. Amen. Let us pray for others. Let us pray for Pope Francis and all those who bring the word of God to people all over the world. May they be brave and courageous. Jesus, hear our prayer. Let us pray for all people who are living in places where there is fighting. May they one day live in peace. Jesus, hear our prayer. Let us pray for our family at home and at church. May we all spread your hope and peace wherever we go. Jesus, hear our prayer. Let us pray for all people who are sick or dying. May they have the love of others who will take care of them. Jesus, hear our prayer. Now, tell Jesus who you would like to pray for. Jesus, hear our prayer. Jesus, help us to follow you each day and ask for the help of your Holy Spirit. Be with us always so that in our own small way, we can be disciples of hope and joy in this world. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. If you love God and you know it and you really want to show it, if you love God and you know it, clap your hands. If you love God and you know it, stamp your feet. If you love God and you know it, stamp your feet. If you love God and you know it and you really want to show it, if you love God and you know it, stamp your feet. If you love God and you know it, shout Amen. Amen! If you love God and you know it, shout Amen. Amen! If you love God and you know it, and you really want to show it, if you love God and you know it, shout Amen. Amen!